Hello, I'm here to introduce the new Tektronix Spectrum Analyzer and how it can be used for YLAN signals. YLAN signals are fast moving and difficult to capture. It's difficult to see YLAN and other signals in the 2.4 GHz ISM band, such as Bluetooth. In this video, we will look at how the RSA 306 with the SignalView PC software can display these fast signals and see the transients. The RSA 306 is a USB connected and powered spectrum analyzer covering 6.2 GHz frequency range. Here, we'll look at how the real-time capability in the SignalView platform can take advantage of this instrument's 40 MHz real-time bandwidth. We start with the instrument in a preset condition, then tune to the frequency band of 2.45 GHz. Then, we turn on the real-time DPX display. Next, we reduce the reference level to make sure that we can see the signal on the screen. The definition of real-time is processing speed that keeps up with the system input. Here we have a USB 3.0 connected spectrum analyzer with a fast enough PC to process the incoming signal and display about 10,000 FFTs per second in a way that's usable for the human eye. Now we're seeing the background YLAN signals in the room. I will turn on the YLAN on my smartphone and you can see the YLAN signals with higher amplitude. It is interesting here, as I load a web page or do something that requires communication between my smartphone and the wireless LAN access point, you can see the interaction between the phone and the access point. The phone, since it's close to the RSA 306, has a higher signal strength and the access point has a lower signal strength. This is interesting because I can see two signals occupying the same frequency but at different times. Also, when I activate the Bluetooth transmitter on my smartphone, I can see many hops of the Bluetooth device searching for another Bluetooth device to pair with, as you can see here. I have my Bluetooth headset here, and once the smartphone pairs with it, the Bluetooth hopping sequences happen much less frequently. This is because there isn't any data being transmitted over Bluetooth, but a link has been established. This illustrates how powerful these real-time displays are. You can see apparent signals under signals with this powerful processing. Thank you for taking time to learn about this USB spectrum analyzer. There's much more to learn about here, like the vector signal analysis, the full-featured spectrum analysis, and the signal recording capability.